I had some extra butcher block from our project that I did and decided to make a gift for a friend. So I wanna show you step-by-step step exactly how I did this. Let's go into the shop. All right, I'm actually making this cutting board for my friend Shannon who moved to Tennessee after not really liking Idaho, but we're still friends, so it's okay. So I'm gonna put a big S in this cutting board for his initial. So I'm gonna just mark off something simple and cut it out with this router. We're gonna take this, I'm gonna put the depth very shallow to start. You don't wanna start too deep when you're cutting in with your router. So make sure this is super shallow when you first start routing out your letter here. Now we're gonna take a torch and torch this whole S. That's gonna get rid of all these burrs, so don't worry about that. All right, I'm gonna spray the S with black paint. I'm gonna let this sit and dry, come back, we'll sand all this off and then cut it to size. So this isn't exactly square. I wanna rip it down on the table saw and just make it a little bit smaller, nice and square. Then we'll sand it, finish it, and then do a nice protective coating on it. Now that we have it all square, we're gonna go sand it down through the grits, soften these corners up, get that black paint off, and then finish it. Super easy to do, right? No excuse. So if you have any extra butcher block, give it a try. Leave a comment if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe. We'll see you next time.